One of the world's tallest women has died in hospital aged 77 after being diagnosed with pneumonia. Maria Felicia dos Santos grew to the astonishing height of 7 feet 3.8 inches in her early 20s, snatching the world record before shrinking as she got older. For many years, Maria held the title of the world's tallest woman. The world's tallest woman living right now, Turkey's Rumisa Gel, measures 7 feet 0.71 inches, still inches off Maria's height record. Relatives of the former singer and basketball player confirmed overnight she had died yesterday at a private hospital in Aracaju, the capital of Sergipe State on Brazil's northeast coast. The pensioner, who had been battling health problems for years, became a household name in her native country after an incredible period of growth during her late teens. She transformed from a normal 10-year-old to quickly claim the title of Brazil's tallest woman, towering high above her contemporaries. The Estado de Sergat Building, a 28-story skyscraper in Aracaju that was the highest in the city when it opened in 1970, is popularly known as the Maria Feliciana Building. Her father, Antonio Tintino da Silva, grew to the astonishing height of 7 feet 8.7 inches, and her paternal grandfather reached 7 feet 5.4 inches tall. She regularly features in online top tens of the world's tallest women ever. She became an attraction during her late teens and toured several cities and performed in circuses in the 60 seconds where she began making waves. At 18, she hit the big time and earned her spot as a national celebrity after being crowned Reina da Altura on a popular Brazilian TV program. She put her traveling on hold after marrying Asuares José dos Santos in 1973 when she was 27. She went on to have three children with him, two sons who grew to nearly seven feet and a daughter. In 2022, a statue of her was erected outside a museum in her home state of Sergipe to honor her life. For the past 15 years, however, Maria was in a wheelchair and largely housebound. The star's funeral is due to take place this afternoon following an overnight wait. Aracaju's mayor at Valdo Nagara decreed three days of mourning as news of her death emerged. He said overnight, I received the news of that Maria Feliciana had passed away with sadness. One of the tallest women in the world. I remember the first time I saw her when I was still a child. It was in Paudia Kukar where I was born. Her presence caused quite a star. My condolences to her family, friends and admirers. May God comfort their hearts. Fabio Mididiri, governor of the state of Sergi, added, I am saddened to learn of the death of Maria Feliciana dos Santos. She left a remarkable legacy, with her name eternalized on the highest building in our state. She put Sergipe and our culture on the national and international map. One of the many well-wishers who wrote tributes posted on her Instagram site said, Rest in peace, Maria Feliciana. My condolences to all your family and friends. You were an icon who represented our city and state. In February, the world's tallest man in the world met up with the shortest living woman to show off their staggering height difference. Sultan Kozen, 41, at 8 feet 3 inches tall sat next to an 2 feet tall Jayoti Amj, 30. Both Kozen and Amj earned their titles in 2011 from the Guinness World Record.